Well, hey, good morning. Um, I am here to show you this thing right here. <clears throat> this is a window that um, <clears throat> I installed in a house in 1995. It was between Christmas and New Year's. Actually, it's 1994. No, it was 1995, almost 96. And so this 19 years ago, 18 years ago. <clears throat> now, in about 2002, I noticed that these uh, windows were really, um, that this water-based uh, stain was not working out as I had hoped. And the wood split right down here in this position. And guess what? I used some of this wood filler. And that would have been in about 2004 or 2006. And there's the wood filler. There's the wood. And I don't know if you can see this. Here's the problem with this wood filler is that it <laughs> does not expand and contract at the same rate that the wood does, this window is on the west side of now, this is near, and we live, this is Germany, right? We live at 52 degrees north latitude where it doesn't really get all that hot. And expansion and contraction between the wood and the wood filler has literally destroyed the darn thing. So, now what I have to do is replace this piece of wood. <clears throat> I'm going to have to take this off and I'm just going to cut it off. And unfortunately, I have soft spots here and I have soft spots here. I don't have any here, but we'll see when I get that out how much I have to do on this side. <clears throat> but I'm going to take this piece of wood and I'm going to cut it out with a router and scab a new piece in and then I will be taking these short sections here these little sections I will probably do by hand to show you how easy it is to replace a piece of wood by hand which is what I recommend to all of you instead of using this putty I recommend you use wood and I'll show you how easy it is because trust me <clears throat> if I can do it you can probably do it 